Um, hi, I'm Emir Gümrükçoğlu from IPMU and I'm going to talk about theories of gravity today. Um, about three centuries ago, uh, Newton introduced a description of gravity which explained both the Earth's pull and also the motion of celestial bodies. Thus, uh, gravity became the first fundamental force that was discovered. Uh, but after the success of standard model of particle physics, gravity is now the least understood one among the four known interactions. Um, our current understanding of uh, uh, gravity, the general theory of relativity, has been established by Albert Einstein in the early 20th century, and uh, its predictions are compatible with the current data from experiments and observations, but it has a fundamental problem. It is incompatible with quantum mechanics, which is the physics of uh, microscopic scales. Experimentally, general relativity has been tested only down to distances of a hundredth of a millimeter, but we keep on searching for new phenomena at smaller distances to test a uh, few promising alternative theories uh, that can consistently describe a quantum gravity. Uh, issues at small distances aside, gravity may need other modifications. For instance, uh, the current observations of the expansion of the universe indicate we might need to introduce some new forms of matter and energy. But alternatively, uh, it may be possible to explain these data with uh, appropriate modifications in general relativity at large scales. In IPMU, we are studying such extended models of gravitation, try to determine their uh, characteristic uh, signatures, and obtain new testable uh, information to understand this mysterious force.